Well, hello my friends and welcome back to my channel. And today we are talking about a new-ish planner. I have had one of these in the past. I will link that video up in a card wherever it goes, I don't know. But I have seen one of these last year and I wanted to share again. This company is called Personal Planner and they reached out to me to help out with their back to school campaign. I know I've had one of these in the past, so I said, sure, why not? Also, there's gonna be a discount code. I will put that in the description down below and right on the screen right here for you guys, as well as there's gonna be something kind of fun coming up at the very end. But one of the gals over there, Amelia, shout out to Amelia if you're watching, hi. She wanted me to just pick out some of the things that I really liked on the website to show you guys. And then I just wanted to go into all of the goodies that are here. So first things first, when I saw these on the website, I knew I wanted to grab one of these. This is a cover. This is the classic A5 size, and they have a couple of different colors. This one is the black. There's also brown and pink and like a mint color and a soft purple, which is really, really pretty. I can just show you what I'm looking at here because I have this up, but this is the one that I got, the imitation leather, which is $26.95. And then there's the calf skin. Um, and then there's a black calf skin, so this is like the brown. And then there's a pink and the mint and the purple. So there's lots of really cool designs. They also come in different sizes. So there's a mini, square, wide, and then the classic A5, which is what I got. So this cover alone retails for $26.95. Um, it's got like the little holes in the back so you can put a bungee cord on there. Um, it does ask you, I believe, when you check out what uh, color you want. So I decided to go for white, but then you can put your planner in there. My planner is already in here, but it's really nice. It has all of these pockets. This came with it. Um, it's just like to show that you can put like cards or anything like that in there. Um, I have, right now I've got some like stickers. I could put some stickers in there like this, which is nice. Or um, I have some other stickers sitting over here too. I could always like slip those into this little pocket too if I wanted to. Um, but yeah, it fits the A5 size perfectly. Um, I did get a bungee for the back of this as well. You don't have to put that on there if you don't want to, um, but I decided to do that. And then on the back side, it looks exactly the same. Um, this does not open on the back side, just like FYI. I know it's kind of hard to see because it's black, but um, this doesn't open on this side. The only pocket that opens is on this side right here. It also has a little pen loop, which is great. I'm gonna put my little Erin Condren marker in there at the moment. So yeah, you can just kind of close this baby up and that's what it looks like. And you can take your little bungee and go like that. But I just saw this cover and I was like, I feel like I need that in my life. It's so pretty and it's just so basic and I really liked it. And um, like I said, it comes in a bunch of different colors as well. So like I said before, this cover is the classic A5 size. So my planner is a classic A5 size as well. So when you go on their website, um, there are several different options to look and see what size, you know, that you would want in your planner. So I chose the classic A5, which is $39.95. And then, you know, there's lots of different ones. So you can just select the one that you want. Um, and then also there's lots of different designs. I actually chose a design. Um, it's hard to see. Let me let me pull it up again. Um, I chose a design that they actually had on their website, um, but there's lots of different options that you can do. So it's kind of this like wintery theme because it's basically winter like half the year here in Minnesota. So um, I chose this one, which I think looks nice. You can also personalize it with like a little personalization right here. I elected not to do that, um, but okay. So when you open up the book, and this is made of like a, I don't know, it's like a really, it's glossy, but it's like really heavy. I wouldn't even call it, I don't know, it's like not cardstock, but it's not, I don't know, it's paper. It's like some sort of paper, but it's very glossy. Um, seems like it would be really durable too, because it's like the high shine or whatever. So when you open this guy up, so on this side, it has a little information about the company. It's made in Sweden. And then um, we, or we, <laughs> 
me, myself, and I, right? Um, then you also get this little guy, or did I purchase this separately? I can't remember. But this is one of those items that is like all, like all the teeth and stuff are open. So um, you can kind of put it wherever you want. So I decided I wanted to put it up in the front. And then I also um, got some sticker sheets. I don't believe the stickers come with the planner. I think these were a separate item, um, but they came as like a really big sheet, but they had these like perforated lines and like this one, like this one has a perforated line in it. I just haven't taken them out like that. Um, but yeah, so I got two different um, sticker sheets of all of these. You can definitely use these in the planner or use your own stickers or not use stickers at all, which I think is totally fine. But love this for sticker storage or receipts or anything else that your little heart desires could go in there. Okay, so now that I'll, that's all in there. Um, and then the next page, you can personalize this as well. And that just has my YouTube name, Favorite Daughter Emily. And then here is the layout that I chose. So this is the very end of 2018, working into the whole year of 2019. You can customize so much stuff with this. Like I, I don't even really want to like show you on the phone because it's just, it's a lot to look at. So I do highly encourage you guys to go on their website and take a peek if you are so interested. Um, but this one is an hourly version. So it goes from 7 a.m. to 11 p.m., which I think is really nice because I, I do use a regular Erin Condren Life Planner in the hour version in my normal daily life. However, I know a lot of people gripe about the hours that they want something that goes later in the day and things like that. This is definitely something that could possibly work for somebody that's looking for that. There is a larger version as well and not necessarily this A5 size. I think it's like an A6, I think it was, but it's a whole lot bigger than this. Um, and then you can customize the interior however you want. Um, I remember when I uh, placed the order that I could put this up here too, which actually matches the front cover, or I could leave it blank or put a different, you know, color or something like that in there. You could also customize, I think you could customize the actual like colors of the dates, I want to say. Um, I'm not sure. It's just really interesting. And then like down at the bottom, you could put like little habit trackers and things like that. Um, so anyway, I like things a little bit more plain as most of you know that watch my channel. So um, on the left hand side you could customize a whole bunch of things in here like habit trackers and things you want to keep track of like your mileage or water consumption or like I don't know whatever you want to do. And then um, over here I kept a couple of different things. So like to do this week I thought would be really good because you can put down like a couple of different tasks and then check them off as you go. And then I like I liked this. I liked this little monthly view of the month we're in. So you could kind of like, if someone's like, oh, in December, what day is this? Or, you know, actually this is like a really bad example. Let's go to January. So like in January, if you're on this week and you're like, oh, well, what day was the third? And you're, you can look at it and say, oh, that was a Thursday. You know, like you can kind of take a peek at that. Um, so anyway, I do like that a lot. Saturday and Sunday are all in one column. Some people love that, some people don't, but that's just the way that this layout is. You can elect not to have the hours in here at, at all. So, I mean, there's so many different versions of layouts that you can take a peek at. Um, also, it says the month and the year, and then over here it says week 52. So it tells you what week you are in the specific year. Also, there is a monthly view. So in January 2019, here is the complete monthly view. I believe you could also elect to have holidays in there, if I remember right. I think that was it. I ordered this a while ago, you guys. I'm sorry. But there are so many um, really great options on this website. So um, just mess around with it a little bit. And the really cool thing too is when you select an option, the view of the image changes. So I find that really helpful to someone that maybe isn't the most visual. So it's like, oh yeah, that's what it's gonna look like. So anyway, and then here is December through January. So we're in week one. So this is December 31 and January one. And again, everything looks the same. So you're gonna have as many weeks as you can rolling through here, and then you will get into your February month. There are no tabs or anything for your actual monthly views. However, you could very, very easily put little adhesive tabs or something like that if you wanted them on there. Um, also another thing that you could do 
is um, like the thing in the back here. If you use one of these covers, or even if you don't, you could always, um, you know, put this wherever you are. You know what I mean? I don't know. Um, so yeah, and then obviously on the monthly view also, there's like a little list there too, which is nice. So yeah, you've got um, January through December in here. And then um, another thing is, hold on, let me show you here. In lieu of doing the little tabs, there are these little guys here. So um, this tells you like what month it's in, the different colors of the rainbow. So it's like January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, and December. So you can see them and you can say, oh, I need to get into like April, which is the fourth month. And you can grab the yellow and you can just, you know, open it like that and then you're in April. So anyway, um, it's just like a little fun design idea instead of the tabs, but if you're into tabs, you could very easily put them on there. So anyway, that is it for the inside of the guts guts, but there are a ton more options with your extra pages. So um, let me show you what I elected to put into mine. So here is my overview for 2019. I really wanted to have this because I thought that this would be a great thing to have when you're like looking forward into the year. So it does have it categorized by month or not by month. Yeah, obviously it's categorized by month, but it's categorized also by week on the page with the red markings right here. So it tells you what week you're in, which is great. It also has like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. So you know what date it is. So if you've got some like trips coming up, if you've got like school activities or kids stuff or other commitments, you can just put those things down like when you're looking forward to things. Also a nice thing is like it tells you like this is Easter Sunday and then like this is Father's Day and Memorial Day. So like you know where they land on the year. So then when you're trying to plan like vacation, say you always get Memorial Day off on work to say, oh, well that'd be a great like long weekend or whatever, like let's go do something fun with the family or whatever. Like you can kind of like look forward into that. So anyway, this is 2019. And then also this is the rest of 2019. And then I elected to also put 2020 in there because how often do we get like invitations to things that are happening really far in advance, like family trips and weddings and things like that, that you just know is coming up, but you're like, Ooh, I can't remember. You can always just take a marker or even take like a little sticky note and put in like, Oh, we're thinking of going on a cruise in mid April of 2020. So you can kind of like just slate that in a little bit. And then when 2020 happens, then you can kind of set up everything if you haven't already fully decided on your dates and things like that or follow up with things. So anyways, so that's 2020 and then the rest of 2020. And then I also elected to have some notes pages. Notes pages are totally my jam and I can't wait to share with you guys some fun things that are happening on my channel for notes pages, but that's coming up hopefully in the next couple of weeks. So anyway, these are just some lined note pages and I gotta tell you like the, the paper is very nice and thick and sturdy. Um, like I said before, I use an Erin Condren in my normal daily life. So this feels a little thicker than the Erin Condren paper, just as like a sidebar. So I just wanted you guys to know that I've got quite a few of the lined pages. And then I also elected to have some graph pages in here as well. So love a little grid page. And then um, it's got like some bigger grids as well as some smaller grids inside of those grids. So I love that. I mean, cause you can still, you know, take notes with these no problem. And then the very back page is also like a grid page. And then it's got our back design, which is the same as the front design. And then um, it's also uh, covered by this plastic. Oh, and I should say, hold on, let's pull this completely out here. Rawr, there we go. Um, the front also has the plastic over it too. So this will definitely hold up really, really well. And then if you don't want to get the cover, you can always just, you know, go for it like this. Cause that makes a lot of sense. Also, another thing that I decided to get was this ruler. Cause I thought a ruler is awesome. Plus like for cutting washi or anything like that. Um, it's nice to just have a ruler or if you want to like, you know, back in your notes pages, if you want to do something with a ruler, I don't know, but, um, I figured in the front is good. Um, 
So that's where I wanted to keep this. There are different colors of the ruler too. I believe this is the gray or silver. I can't remember the name of it. It's not the clear one. Um, and I think there's like a blue, I wanna say, and maybe a green. I'm not sure, but there's a couple of different um, ruler options. So anyway, that is a look at this planner in all of its glory. I'm gonna take my little pen out of here. Let's take my funny little paper American Express out of here too. <laughs> All right, so let's talk about something really, really fun. So Amelia at Personal Planner wanted to do a giveaway with you guys. So I'm so, so excited to have one of you have one of these amazing things. The amazing part of it is they ship worldwide. So this giveaway is going to be open internationally. What you will receive if you do win is a $59.95 gift credit towards their website. You will get an email from the company with your code and then you can use that and personalize your personal planner however you would like, as well as maybe pick up a couple accessories depending on what planner that you choose. The rules for the giveaway are gonna be super, super simple. Okay, you have to subscribe to me on YouTube. That's pretty easy because most of you guys are already subscribed. The actual giveaway will be held on Facebook. So. There's gonna be two different ways to get an entry. The first way is you follow me on Facebook and you follow Personal Planner on Facebook. The second way is you follow me on Instagram and then follow Personal Planner on Instagram as well. I know not everyone has Instagram, so I wanted to make this a little bit more accessible and host this on Facebook. All of the information will be down below as to where you need to go and also on the post on Facebook, which will like be in big letters saying giveaway. It'll be pinned to the top by the time that this video happens. That'll have all the information as well. This giveaway will then close on July 30th. That is a Monday. I will select a winner at random and then I will let Personal Planner know who that is and they would be contacting you shortly with your unique gift certificate code. Also, speaking of gift certificate codes, now until August 20th, there is a 15% off coupon code to anybody else that either doesn't win or just wants to check out the site and make a little purchase. Again, the description box will have that down below as well as I will put that right here for you guys again if you want to jot that down. So yeah, that's it. Two ways to enter. Follow me and Personal Planner on Facebook and follow me and Personal Planner on Instagram and I'll be hosting everything on Facebook for you guys. So links will be down below. So that is it. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much to Personal Planner for reaching out and letting me host this really fun giveaway. And I'm so excited that this is open worldwide. So I hope you enjoyed the video and I will see y'all a little bit later. Bye guys. Well folks, it's time to kick it old school.